also crap. Mara does a crap job at running away from things. Don't jog slowly while looking behind you. Here we go, here we go, don't get impaled. Don't get impaled. That'd be great if we didn't die. Okay. Oh god, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Oh god, I'm sorry. Oh boy, okay, okay, we're going, we're good, we're good. Look, the button said to use your axe, use your axe. Oh god, all of, all of the people, oh boy, all of the people. Woman, <laughs> okay, we got air oh, to find high ground. Yes, you do. <laughs> oh, here we go again. Okay, we got a wall, we got a wall. Oh, we need to move. We need to move. Kids falling from buildings. I lost it. After everything that my father that's, went through, I gave really the point exactly what they wanted. At He'll the use the box and the knife to remake the world. To remake it into what? I don't know. He, he thinks he can rid it of sin and weakness. A man like that, we we have to stop him. It's all my fault. We'll figure it out, okay? I, I promise. No, 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 no! We have to get to the hidden city before Trinity. We have to find the silver box. Okay, but first. We're gonna help these people get to safety, and then we'll go after the box. No, no one is safe! 
Not if he gets the box first. I have to go. I'm the only one. You're the only one that can what? You don't know that you caused all this, Laura. Not everything is about you. These people need us here. We can do good now. Besides, what do we got to go on? A riddle? We're going to need more than pink fish and silver crowns to get to the hidden city. Okay, everybody, take a breath. I'm going to help these people. And then I'll find us a plan. And Jonah is right. You can't just abandon these people. They need help. You need to do something helpful too, Lara. Even though it's awful. Well, they made it to Peru. Jonah is still upset. I think... We're looking for a volcanic mountain. The crown of silver is probably a band of clouds. I just can't get those people back there out of my head. Yeah? They lost everything. The riddle says... Chase the heart of the serpent to the Silver Crown Mountain, where the twins confer. I wonder what the twins are. <sighs> this storm looks like bad news. It's just a little rain. Just a little rain? We just had a tsunami, and guess what was we'll the second thing on, on that cloudy mural? Mountain. Cloudy Mountain. If we find it, how do we know we have the right one? Gut feeling? It's our only clue. The mural says there'll be more disasters. Like a storm. The best way we can help them is to put a stop to it and Trinity. Okay. But how do we really know? Jonah, what I felt when I took the dagger. You mean the tremors of the tsunami? More than that. It felt like I woke something up. I know that it's not practical. I know that it's hard to believe, but you need to trust me. Oh, come on. We've been through two games already with supernatural crap happening. We have to trust each other. Yeah, Laura, you need to trust Jonah. Hey, I might have something over here. Really? That's it! How do you know? I don't like this storm. Should we come back in the morning? We're so close. I guess a little turbulence wouldn't stop Trinity either. Miguel, is there anywhere to land? Yeah, I can put you down near Coagdeco. Let's go. I'm sorry, that really does Oh, was it a gigantic hailstorm? It looked like a bowling ball. What are you doing? I'm gonna level it! Here we go. You know what happens from here. It's 
somehow Laura survived that. And what wasn't broken before is now broken. Oh, definite rough landing. Okay, so we definitely... This is... Ugh, swampy and gross. Got birds. We've got monkeys. Plants. Excellent. Could be useful. It will be useful, I'm sure. <laughs> it's so heavily dense with vegetation, though, is absolutely incredible. I'll There's... keep this for later. Jonah! Can anyone hear me? Keep yelling like that, something will definitely hear you, but it probably won't be the people you want. Where are they? I have to find them. I'm gonna go around the other way. Just because I can. Yeah. Getting closer. It does have a bit of snow on it too, that's what they could mean. Someone's over there. The I have to get to them. Okay. Oh god. Somehow, your hands do not break when you do that. Excellent. Howlers. But you didn't see the other ones in the in the forest while you were down there. Man, you're gonna make them mad at you. That's delightful. That's super delightful. Gross, gross, gross. A fire. Someone must be around. Hello? That they've Jonah. all God, how long were you out? That they've Can already lit a fire. Where are you? The monogram reads P-H-F. That has to stand for Percival Harrison Fawcett. But who was who was Percival Percival Harrison Fawcett? This is the flight log from our plane. 
Miguel made notes about the long-term weather forecast. Warm, hot and dry for the next three days. Highs in the low thirties, mostly clear skies with nothing but light rain expected. Based on his other entries, if Miguel had thought the chances of a severe storm were better than half, he wouldn't have flown us at all. But there was no storm predicted, let alone something serious. Yeah. Amazing that it just happened. I didn't know the storm would hit so hard. This is all my fault. I should have listened Probably. to Jonah, thought it through. I never should have taken that dagger. Well, no. No one else was hurt. No other village destroyed. Yes, I need I mean, to stop what? these cataclysms before it's too late. I look. Oh, that costs two. Let me take stuff that's worth that's only one right now. Um. Yeah, stealth kills without alerting anybody is good. Never slip when grabbing ledges. That's nice. Also reducing damage. Um, but I think I want to be able to get poison and I want to be able to know where to hit my targets. Okay. We'll use that stuff for now. Of course the monkeys are getting into your things. My gear is in that cargo. I'll need to cut it down. How dare they. I can't Won't get in. Yeah, I don't have that about at all. Maybe a piece of scrap from the wreck. Indeed. He's managed to do the. Oh, good lord. Get away! Get away! Ow! You jerk! Get away! Stinking eel! Anything I can get while I can still get it, so. Might as well take what I can from the bottom of the lake. Or, it's not really a lake, well, it's a pond. Huddle? Whatever. Capybara! But it's dull. I need to find something oh. to sharpen it. Fine. Was I not paying attention to what I needed to do? I think I need more scrap, probably. Exactly what I was looking for. Just need a bit more. Okay. Well, might as well just go around gathering all of the things. Ooh, 
Hey, game, stop that. you oh hello oh I don't have anything to do that with there you are I've got everything I need should head back to camp I should head back to camp I guess I will. Taking the long way, though. Get me, Paris! I don't know why I am so happy to see capybaras. I just really like them for some reason. They just make me smile. Oh, where am I going? That's not the way to camp. There it is. Yay! I have a knife. And also, I have outfits. But you know what's awesome? Okay. So, there are outfits from the previous uh, Tomb Raider games. And it actually totally makes her look like the Lara from those games. Isn't that amazing? But you know what's even better? Original Lara Croft. I can play the game like this! Which is ridiculous and amazing. Oh. But no, I will be dressing amazingly awesome is how I'll be dressing. That should be sharp enough. <sighs> I love how we, we actually have a knife sheath, in, in fact. Something's still holding the supplies up. I can get my gear back. <sighs> that is a beautiful bow. Why didn't I pack all my equipment together? I don't know. You probably should have. Even alive. You got cracked in the head with a gigantic piece of hail. But we'll find you in a minute. We've got some stuff to do around here. Like hunting. That's gross, man. I see ribs. Okay. That's great. I'm just gonna, like, kill all the bugs I see. Didn't even see the bug I just killed. I'll be back for you once you're not panicking, Capybara.
No! That's right. First things first. There is, in fact, something down here. Come here, bug. Cusco belongs to Hernando Pizarro, rightful representative of the Spanish crown. Diego de Almagro has been captured. Rodrigo Orgones is dead, and the rest of their heretic forces routed. We made a crossing over the mountains and appeared on the coast outside of Cusco. Orgones marched to meet us at Cachupampa, a poor choice for his cavalry. His falconets threw Gonzalo's infantry charge into disorder, but the swampy ground prevented his seasoned cavaliers from true advantage. Our imperial arquebusier breached the river and unleashed hellfire on the opposition. Pizarro and Orgones led their respective cavalries, each merging to a single charging column all of the men yelling and met at full gallop. I had never seen such a thing. Somewhere in the chaos of battle, Orgones was shot and unhorsed and killed. They say the coward Almagro retreated from the battlefield atop an ass. Fitting. Excerpt from Alonso Luiz's journal. I don't know who that is either, but, you know, maybe we'll be told, or maybe it's just one of those... Okay, we've got a creepy place. Oh, this is yeah, that's lovely. That's oh, okay. careful, careful. Suck it all in, every little bit of it, cause. Ugh. That's nice. That's real great. Wonder where this will lead. Down. It's gonna lead down. <laughs> okay, we've got... 30th of May. Who's Jack? This morning we entered uncharted territory, leaving the sun-bleached bones of dead horse camp behind. It seems the tables have turned on Rally, almost quite literally. His bandaged leg has slowed his pace and made him the tail of our party. When Father notices, he slows, turning around to give us both an encouraging smile. His overly eager step betrays his calm demeanor as he rushes past us at the sight of every nearing turn, ridge, or embankment. Okay, um, that's... That's great. Where would I have found Jack's Journal 1? No idea who Jack is. But... May Ergu be the one to chart the path from this life to the next, so that we may all travel safely. Okay, well that's nice. What do we have here? Yep, that's that's right. Defile that tomb. And take their boots. You totally went in that. Drag somebody's boots out of their crypt. And you're just like, yeah, I'm gonna keep those boots. Those are nice boots. Okay. <laughs> Gotta remember to come back here when That's I get my got to be the way up. Uh climbing axe back. <laughs>
Oh, shit! It's okay. We know how to jump, Laura. It's fine. Oh, God. Yeah! It's always so horrible when, when we, when, you know. Actually, oh no, I, I still, no, Laura, don't. It's like when, it's like my finger is accidentally a little too far over and you hit the wrong button. You realize it right when it happens. Like, oh, got no. to be the way up. Barely, barely had to walk in the mud. This seems to describe a hidden chamber nearby. Really? I wonder what that could be talking about. Huh. How odd. Okay, okay, get- okay, alright, let's- let's not- Okay, Lara, you're- you stop- Stop touching the dead person's butt. All right. <laughs> and we're out of there. Now, I know that there is a challenge to nearby with its... Uh, Mara. <laughs> but this horrible, creepy mask. Man, game is, uh, stuttering quite a bit for me. But I also know that it requires gear that I don't have to get into it. So, I don't have my, um, climbing axe. Back to camp. Because I'm also going to change out my bow. Got a skill point. So let's see. That requires two and two. And what's this? Um... Yeah, let's reduce damage from falling from heights, because I am more likely to do that. Okay, I can craft upgrades. It's just so much better. I don't know why in the world I would ever. But... Upgrades, um, yeah, so, all right, so there's also these that I got, um, so this is confused, like, 
like, what's actually pretty darn cool is that you've got these full body costumes and then you've got the uh, things where you can switch out the upper and lower body, which I think is pretty cool. I don't know why it keeps telling me that I've got new stuff in my inventory, though. I don't. I have also, like, looked at everything in my inventory game, so I don't know what you want from me. And now we will continue. And also kill this... Maybe. It's a little bit loud in my ears. Okay. Man, I guess I got used to the volume, because putting this back on, it seems very loud. <laughs> Hello. I like how she's even looking at it. It's got to be something I can eventually uh, get, like, bugs. Dang it. There we go. <laughs> Alright. Just because I feel like murdering things. Ooh, what's that? Something I can hit. That's what it is. Some kind of nest? Now I feel bad. <sighs> okay, we've got some kind of flowers. Apparently, in this game, we make some kinds of, like, mixtures for, like, added perception and things. of the things. Alright. We're ready. Let's get moving. Shall we? Yeah, I, I know you're just hanging there, Lara, but come on. Look at that. Oh, that's so awesome. can just hear the rushing water down there. And I see something shiny in that general direction. Miguel? I don't like this. I don't like this either. Miguel? Uh, was that a shoe? Where are you? Oh. Oh no. <sighs> oh Miguel? dear. Miguel? Oh, there's both of his shoes. Oh, I'm so sorry, Miguel. Bye. There's. There's not much we can do for Miguel at this point, I doubt. Oh, boy. God, that is a really loud flare. Okay, uh, there's his... Is that a backpack? I think it's a backpack. Okay, well, the blood goes that way. Every part of the world seems to have its own mythical, forest-dwelling, bipedal creature. 
Around here, it's known as the Sisamite, the guardian of the forest. Described as large and ape-like, it's rumored to kill male humans on sight, but takes the females to its cave for mating purposes. It's, um... I'm not terribly happy with hearing that. Okay. Miguel? Miguel? Why are we following the blood? This does not seem safe. That's too much blood. Miguel's dead. Laura, you are an idiot. Are you serious? Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Monkey? There! Eat the monkey! Okay. What do you want me to do, game? Right, I killed a monkey. So all of you need to stop staring at me right now. Got to be careful here. Yeah. This isn't nerve wracking at all. Yeah, that was another monkey. Oh, okay. Man. I can't get that either. That sucks. Oh, gotta get a squeeze through areas. That's lovely. Oh, oh, good lord. Hi. Okay. Oh, dear. Oh, God, I'm waiting in muck. That's nice. De oh, I'm sorry, defeat the jaguars. That's it. Ow!
me alone! Another one. Okay. That doesn't seem normal, but what part about that seemed anywhere near normal? Okay. Okay. There's plenty of stuff around here. That's good. Plenty of birds, too. Oh, cloth. Uh, cloth. There we go. A whole lot of cloth there for some reason. Jeez, how many people does this do these jaguars kill? You'd think that there wouldn't be a whole lot of people to kill, but what do I know? Maybe a lot of people live out here in this territory. I don't know. Certainly enough to leave a whole lot of cloth laying around. This is everything. Double checking. Alright, don't see anything else. Oh boy. Alright. Oh! That's part of the wreckage. Yes. Jonah! Extremely observant there, Lara. Lovely water. There's the bush. Okay, yes, I know I can climb trees, thank you. <sighs> They are all marked up by jaguar claws, though, which is terrifying. Sixth of June. Father's outward enthusiasm is at an all-time high, though I have doubts. In the middle of the night, I have caught the whites of his eyes reflecting moonlight, his stare vacantly locked to the stars. Were it not for all the stories he has shared of the Amazon in the past, I would mistake his gaze as regretful, even mournful. Perhaps it is simply these insects making their way through our head nets causing him such consternation. Maybe. All right. 
Yeah. Alright, so we've got some ways up. Oh, hello. Is that a candle? First of August. Tonight, sleep escapes us. The jungle is angry and the moon is uncooperative. The human imagination wanders endlessly in the dark this deep. I can hear the jungle's breath ruffling behind my ears, its low growl shaking the very ground we lay on, its manic energy rustling through the trees above. Rest has become the lead on our search, finding us at the most inopportune time. I have caught father dozing off mid-step and his hand barely clutching his walking stick. We have run out of food and are sustained almost entirely by gathered berries and rainwater. The both of us are far too unyielding to give up. I fear the very stubbornness that led us to this point may also be that which leads us to our early graves. Goodness. Well, I'm... Where's Journal 4? Because we went from 3 to 5. Look at this water! Oh, it's so pretty! We're gonna go this way, see what's up here. Oh, what do we have here? Oh, this is where I'm going. I don't want to go there. I refuse. I want to go exploring other places first. Like beautiful waterfall pools. And ruins. Oh, but I don't have my climbing axe. Never mind. fish doing that. I'm getting away from them. I don't know what they're doing and it's weird. Alright, well. I guess if I can't get in there, I will go to the place I'm supposed to go because we really do need to find Jonah anyway. <laughs> Hello, little bug. <clears throat> okay. The plane. Yes, Jonah, the plane. The plane, the plane. <clears throat> Whoa, okay. <sighs> Miguel. Yeah. He didn't make it. <sighs> What's wrong with your arm? Ah, some sort of parasite. Ew! I was looking for some warm wood, but it doesn't grow around here. Let me see. <laughs> what are you doing? If we leave it in there, it'll only get worse. Sit. Oh, <sighs> lovely. We're gonna... Ugh. Sure, you know what you're doing. Sure, I'm a doctor. Uh, <laughs> I had something similar happen to me when I was a child in Egypt. I won't lie, it's gonna hurt. You think that storm from earlier was the storm? The one from the mural? I don't know. Uh, I think maybe we should 
Stop and take stock. We've been pushing so hard forward. <laughs> Flying into that storm. I didn't think it was gonna be that bad. I... Well, I should have insisted we turn back. I mean, I get it. You lock onto a problem and everything else just disappears. <laughs> Jonah. I, I, I'm with you. It's my choice most of the time. But if we die, who stops the cataclysms? Who keeps Trinity from doing what they there want? There you go. Sometimes I feel like I have to keep going, and if I don't, then I'll just let everyone down. But maybe for the sake of a few hours, we could have turned back. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Ew! <laughs> Maybe we should give him a name. Okay. Eli? No, my cousin. He's always trying to get under my skin. <laughs> Goodbye, Eli. Gross! Thanks. We should go. If we can find Kowakyaku, we can rest for the night. Sounds good.